Hello beautiful people is Derek Sakelvo man I normally come here just once every week man and one thing I really need to tell you guys man we only just post whatever we always post in my TikTok is something that I'm really trying to get it to do it in in English so that you can put it even in YouTube so that many people can understand the story that we always bring it for you guys in TikTok but I'm trying my best to bring this thing man in YouTube so guys man wherever man you see me coming through guys man at least once a week i'm guys coming to talk to you on whatever has happened maybe in the weekend blah 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 you know man so one thing here you should understand man this life men never trust anybody never trust anybody but put people around you never trust but work with people around you this world is so cruel man me na ambia tu kweli me in whatever that kama in everything that i've passed through i've really learned a lot in everything that i've passed through man i've really learned a lot and right now that i'm 30 years old man there are some things that i cannot talk deeply because of whatever that i'm passing through man I cannot but I will just try to put for you some clues and for you to put them together I'm afraid to tell you about these things about spiritual things man when me I'm passing through this thing right now and it is not it has not started right now it's something that has been there since 2014 on my life man I think 2014 there or maybe 2012 man it is been it has been long man but you guys man it's real so i've been trying to coming to come for you guys here and talking to you about spiritual realm and everything that's happening man so the other day and it's always happening to me whenever it comes to hidi i don't know why it always happened to me like this man i don't know when i was i was even back and then my mom uh, took me to muslim because right now i know how to read uh, Quran and I can read even Juzu these are the books spiritual books of Islamic is just like bible eh? and Juzu is like starting to know the vowel and everything that is there so man I've been re- I've been reading this book man I know even the Lord's prayer in, in Muslim and everything so I can really understand where this thing came from you guys man you should understand another thing Whenever you guys have been born or wherever we've been born man since day one we always have a spiritual friend who always guide us a spiritual being that is always beside us these are the things that you people or christianity always call them a uh, guardian angel this thing is real man it's real and something that you really need to check on this thing and whenever these people that are always doing a uh, astro projection <laughs> i really pity these people so much man i really pity these people because they don't know what they're getting themselves into because to me i've never occurred about this thing like this way or i don't know how i can put it because i've told you here a number of without time man like i've been dreaming about certain girl and this girl man i can know his face and face very well and they she always talks to me man she has really taught me a lot of things that is happening around this world man and i really appreciate but one thing that the mother told me about this girl one day will come physically or again spiritually because there is a lot of war in the spiritual realm right now and the reason is i have another sword that this girl gave me in the spiritual realm and i normally use it whenever i get this weird weird uh, dreams i normally use it a lot and i don't know why and i don't know where i normally get it from 
because you can get me running in my dream but i will get to that sword it's so funny man when i talk this way but man it's very scary at the same time and i'm trying my best at least to give you some clues so whenever you see these people always doing this thing like projection astro projection man i really pity these people because they don't know what they're getting themselves into uh, this being so is uh, that those who are black and those who are white and one thing that i've really learned man because this lady always come to me you always have a, a fringe hair and long black hair and you always wear uh, dera or linen a white linen but bright one and she's very pretty and we always talk a lot we always talk a lot sorry guys there is a lot of a lot of nini noise outside so i was telling you this thing man so i've been trying my best at least to come here and tell you this story because this story is real that's why i'm normally putting it in my tiktok account Whenever you guys go to my TikTok account, you may find those people understand Kiswahili. They will really understand the story that I'm trying to bring out here. But I will try my best to bring it in English, formal, because still I'm talking with this guy that is narrating this story too. Because I really need to know if he can do the video itself so that we can bring a movie out of it, like Zora, those kind of movie, something that can go. And people will understand like what is really going on because me i'm good in effects and videography i can do it very well so i'm just trying to get this guy on board so that you can get this story everything about this story so that we can do what put them in video form that's the only thing that we are trying to do but right now i'm just trying to bring them for you guys in tiktok from tiktok Again, I will bring them into YouTube for in English version. But right now, we are getting them in, in, in Kiswahili form. That's why you're seeing them in Kiswahili in my TikTok. Right now, we are in 32. Yeah, be so 32, man. It's a lot, man. Because one thing you can you have, you have to understand, you can get even, I mean, episode 20 or 19, but you can get in episode 19 or 20. We got part A, part B, part C. So it's so long. This thing is so long, but it is a very good story to learn about all of these things. So the reason why I'm talking this way, man, is it's something that is so deep on my side. I cannot come and tell you something that I don't know. I cannot come and try to put for you a story that I, it is not even there yet. Men, we have to be real in this world at the same time. We have to be real. But for me, I normally pity these people that are always talking about astral projection. If you have not gone to spiritual realm, if you have never been carried like this, going to this spirit place where they, they stay, then you don't know what you are talking about. You don't know whatever... What, or whatever that is happening around you man me right now whenever I'm, the, I'm in this world right now i feel very bad and very i don't know how i can put it man but i feel like this world is not home man it is not somewhere that you can call home in this world man I'm telling you the truth man we don't have to trust anybody but we have to work with people around us that's the only thing i can Come here and tell you guys, man. Don't trust everybody, but have people around you so that you can work with them, man. Because you don't know what whoever is sitting beside you, you will never know. But it's something that we really need to think about whenever you're going out, man. Me nowadays, even if I see I'm outside, man, I'm seeing weird things. Weird things. Maybe we can be at the road. You see, like this is a road and everything is perfect. But for me, my eyes is seeing something else. I've reached that point, man. I've reached that point. There is a day I went to this church. Uh, it, it is called what? Maximum Me Melody Church. And it was one Friday. I think it was three months back. Or you see, the idea, the first ED, I went there. I was feeling a little bit low and I just wanted to sit somewhere quietly just thinking about myself and everything. 
There's another woman who just came wherever I see her is hurt and then he started to call me with by my name of Muslim and I told her man that name I use it when I was small and right now man that is not my name. And he, and she told me man I can see that you have a lot of fighting. What are you fighting for and why are you this way? Man I just told that that woman man there's a lot of things that I'm passing through and there is nothing they can do about it man right now because it's something that I don't know how I got myself in this thing. I don't know. Whenever whenever I normally come to you guys and I tell you man, whenever you see me this way and then you see me like um at times I'm alone man. <laughs> hey, this life man it can push you to the wall. Because, man, I'm in between. I'm in between of this thing, man. There's some spirit that want me to go this side. And there's some others who want me to be this side. And it is a fight that that is so hard. Because whenever I'm in this other side, men are being tormented with this other side. Whenever I'm trying to be on this side, this side always pulls me back, man. It is so crazy because I don't know how I can put it. The only thing I'm just trying to give you like whatever that is happening because I know a lot. Whatever is happening on this other side and this other side of spirit realm. So crazy, man. So I told this woman, man, whatever you're seeing, man, that's how it is. But he told me, she told me like, ah, I can see that you have something like a weapon, like a sword or like a panga. And I told her, yeah, I do always, I always have a dream that I normally have this sword that is always like gold plated and silver plated. It has ruby of red and blue. And this woman just saw me and then she just shook my head. But she just shook her head and she was like, whoa, so deep, man. So, deep. so you guys man I cannot go further from here but you guys man let us see each other tomorrow and man I love you guys so much and whenever you normally don't see me man yes no there man I'm doing something other than this because at the end of the day we have to eat we have to do other stuff at the end of the day so guys man I really love you so much man you are the only people that I can talk to whenever you see me on your screen like this because me, for me, I don't have friends man. But whenever I see you guys coming to my my likes or maybe TikTok, YouTube, I really appreciate you guys so much. So for that man, let's go to my next one. Whenever things are getting hard man, I know whenever man, you are the best people to come around man. So guys man. See the next one. Kaboom. Ume shuka noja kutoa na kirende. Chipe mwenyewe. Usichelewe. Tukicheza na masa mbele mbele. Kadunda. Banyushe mikono ju. Kadunga. Toka apto madhare turunda. Lazima ngoko watingishi iso duda. Jusi ndio mabuda. Kadunda. Banyushe mikono ju. Kadunga. Toka after madhare turunda Lazima ngoko watengishi hizo duda Jusindo mbona dae